Hey guys, for today's video, I've got a W3 Champions game against Colorful. It looks like he started to play here uh, on W3 Champions. He is from China. He just won exactly one month ago the World Championship WGL, $25,000 for first place. And here is a ladder game against him. He's random. I don't know what race he's going to be, so I have to do a generic opener. But he's going to be Night Elf. That's his main. Good luck to me. Unless the mods do like a two minute and you decide right after you see the race. Yes. His random has really high orc percentage. It's five out of six orc, one out of six elf. Against me anyway. <laughs> Um, I think there's only one valid build against random. Farseer, delayed headhunter, fast tech. It's what works against Night Elf. It's okay against Orc, it's okay against Human. It's not ideal against Undead, but I mean, the best is is Elf. So I either need to play Blade, Creeping, Peon Scout, standard against Elf. Or I need to do delayed uh, headhunter, fast tech, farseer headhunters, if he's elf. So if I gear all my strats towards his main race, which in Colorful's case definitely is his best, which is uh, therefore worth considering to keep the most, uh, yeah, to keep the most counter ability against. I think it's worse against Undead, and I don't know how strong his Undead is. His Elf is significantly stronger than his Orc, and it is Elf. Okay, he Wisp scouted us. Now we know. We go to him. We need more lumber. We need more lumber. We need more uh, lumber. I don't know if I should go straight towards him or uh, take a turtle, but I, I think I should go straight towards him. After all, he must be creeping faster than me. Watch out. And he chose Treants first, which is different. It actually allows me to be halfway aggressive. have a wisp somewhere or he wouldn't feel good doing this nice. nice he likes entangling wolves but it uh, when he goes entangled first he didn't go entangle first this time so he's really crippled and this shouldn't happen right like he shouldn't get things lost hit by auto attacks so he's really uncomfortable now he's not supposed to be in this situation lol still no level up this is awkward as hell He 
could just like detonate the wolf. And he did.
Mountain giants. Next big death. Do you need to be my dream? The my eyes will complete. I answer the call. Right, dream. Too bad I wasn't in range of that raider. What you want me to do? Do you need my counsel? Take your time. Look around. Yeah, ready to ride. So uh, one improvement he made from the game against Lin is that he no longer turned his back on the rock golem camp. He did the camp at the same time and Lin creepjacked him something fierce. But this time he pulled them, he was satisfied to keep his panda level 2 for a while longer. Here's I think where I made the big mistake, giving him position on my expansion. I had a sick early game. But I gave him the position on my expansion, which uh, was so close to finishing, I really needed to scout, intercept, stop him. And uh, there should be no, uh, yeah, it should not be allowed at all that someone with only archers is able to make it across the map with Panda level 2 against my basically ready army. And this is kind of where it went wrong, right? Like I take a lot of damage from Shadow. Uh, Panda is level 2.2. This is where it goes wrong. Like he knows about the expand. I'm out of position. So I actually can still make it there. I just need to not creep this camp. So I need to be a lot more mindful about making myself a wall. Uh, like I'm actually super far ahead. Put myself as a wall in between this and him. Uh, it may need me to speed scroll there. 